new high tech way of recording. High tech, he says, recording. Um, anyway, because someone died last part, not mentioning any names here. Who died? We have to fight the hind again. Oh, you did. Yeah. No, you're the one playing the game. Sorry, uh, we weren't mentioning so names. Fight the hind were again. We? Why are you calling me brother? Who the hell are you? And this time, win, he says, lion. This next half an hour is just the hind fight. You're kidding me. No, I am kidding you. I would have, you I would have raged quit before. And you should. You are kidding me. I can see you. I am kidding, kidding me. You can scan ahead in the video. You can yeah, that's what I've just done. I've, as soon as you said it, although spoilers, no. some or spoilers, some of them. Um, well, no, I just went ahead to see. We're not on the rooftop. Okay, that's fine. Oh, fine. Um, so yeah, it's the same as last time. Use your stinger missiles to shoot the hind down. As aside from the fact that you died at the end of the last one, I can't really remember exactly what happened. Not much. It was much more of an action episode. It had the uh, famous and dreaded staircase of doom. Oh that, god. Yeah, that yeah. staircase is fucking not. Should never have been in the game, ever. Worst part of the game by far is the... Mainly because it handles like absolute arse, because the game is not made for it. So another very easy boss fight. I would say easy, but you have to remember, Snake earlier did defeat a tank using only grenades. Yes, that is very true. So he was, I'm frankly surprised, not as ridiculous as the Twin Snakes remake, where he jumps off one of the missile's liquid fires, bounces off that, fires the missile back at him, and blows him up. The Twin Snakes remake is way more ridiculous, even by the standards of the game. So yeah, we're just shooting down a hind. You must feel sad. It's the last to see of it. No! We'll get blown up. Aww. Aww. It's my favourite kind of We get a higher in the next game. Well, briefly. We get... Well, we don't get it. I, 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 I like helicopters more. You would like helicopters. I just like helicopters more. It's something about them. They're just so not as quite as graceful as aircraft. They just hover. And are a bastard to fly in flight simulators. So it's a Harrier jump jet in the next one. Uh, you, 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 as I say you get the jump jet. You shoot down jet. Because the upgrade went, ah, hind D's are for pussies. <laughs> Harrier jet. In the so it, well, we get a hind in the same sense. Well, it's a Harrier jet in the same sense that we get the hind in this one then. In terms yes. Of, it's a thing you shoot. It's like you get the many tank. things you shoot. Um, and you do shoot stinger missiles, right? Like. Still trying to work out what that alarm sound is from. I swear I've tried it in the song before. You've heard it in this? No, in other things. I, I, it reminds me of I just it's the same stock alarm sound they found somewhere. Man, this roof must have made tougher stuff. Not Nothing got damaged by that. Has to be. So this, is, this, is, this, is, this is the high level Alaskan build quality. When yep. governments build their secret bases, they build them to last. Is it hind or hindy? What's the difference? Uh, it's the model. Oh, but it's still a hind. Yeah, it's still a hind. It's just the model. The model. You an upgrade version now with more missiles. <laughs> Boom! It's, it's it's a variant. Which one has Tesla coils on it? No, none of them. All we know, all know, all Russian military vehicles have Tesla coils on them. Now we're just waiting for him to come back up. Uh, just follow him. I forget I have a radar, so I can just. Ow. I'm fine. Perfectly fine. Here we are. The Hind E. Hind E. Which one is it? It's the Hind E that rather than is it E or D? D. 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 Uh, so I'm here we are. Let's make it begin. A Hind D. So it's the Mil Me 24D was a purer gunship than the earlier variant to enter production in 1973. The uh, Me 24D had has a redesigned forward fuselage with two separate cockpits for the pilot and the gunner. 
It is armed with a single 12.7mm four barrel Yak B machine gun under the nose. It can carry four 57mm rocket pods, four Salcos NM17 Falanga anti tank missiles, a significant enhancement compared to the MCLOS system found on the mill on the Mi 24A, plus bombs and other weapons. Uh, we're about to blow it up. There you go. So, a lesson on military vehicles. Uh, do, 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 do. Almost dead. That didn't hit. That hit something else. Do, 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 do. Oh, so there's two boss fights in this one. There's another boss fight at the end. And a very sad moment at the end. Bye bye. Hide. I've got Hide. mixed feelings about this. About what? Th this in the game. Why? On the plus side, it means that we can move forward with the game. On the downside, you're shooting my favourite helicopter. Well, just put this way, Liquid had good taste in his helicopters. Although he got given it by someone. Uh, 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 missiles! Ah, he'll be fine. Somehow he is, he just walked off that and like... A poor helicopter. Well, it's gone now. He can't be shooting whilst he's in there. No, he's got someone in there with him, hasn't he? I see. I can't see. I thought. I think I saw the. I think I was going to say there has to be because se as we just established, there's a separate gold yes. cockpit for the gunner and a separate one for the pilot. See you in hell. And we'll never he, see him again. He's not dead. Like he survives a fall of the top of a mech on the concrete floor, and then a car crash after that, and he's still not dead. Liquid's a fucking Terminator, in levels of what he can survive. Well, he's liquid metal, isn't he? Yeah, yes, it's, it's Robert Patrick, that's actually who he is. We're looking for John Connor. My initial thing was, uh, actually, was Monty Python. I'm not dead! Yes, pretty much. That time that conveniently. Oh, I had to take out that helicopter. Helicopter? That's incredible, Snake. Listen, I just want Nah, the tank with the grenade, I think is more incredible. Where Metal Gear is being stored. Yeah. The entrance to the underground maintenance base is towards the back of the snowfield ahead. Okay. Find a safe place to hide out for a while. I'm going underground. I know, I know. You don't have to tell me. And stay out of my way. Don't try to be a hero. Oh, that's really sweet. They are so gay. So wait, so say Mario Sons 4, they have a child. They not? Th they get a child through means of... Oh, I remember you actually vaguely... Yes. I've got a vague recollection of you mentioning it. It's very uh, homoerotic and kind of the heterosexual life partner. We'll go with that. Were you, were you having trouble going down, the s going down these stairs there for a moment? You were just running. Run at the if I run up the stairs hard enough, I'll be fine. Running on the spot. Are you getting, you're getting, you're getting some cardio in. Um... At least we get a lift down. Sadly, the lift's not on this floor. So be... Oh, for the love of God. <laughs> um, because that's not that's inconvenient. But not as many stairs as before. And we'll need those famous bullets. Famous, famous. However you pronounce it. Do do so. Back downstairs. Da na na na. Do, 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 do. There are turrets around here, there's just one I've got. Chair yeah, the turrets. Whee! Do, 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 do. Ah, oh, it's more fun, Mario Side 2. You can throw yourself downstairs. <laughs> Another chaff grenade. Should have been an option to slide down the banister. Complete with a wee. There's a turret. I know. We've been past several of them so far. That's why I have the chat. I was going to say fireflies. It's fireflies. Woo. 
actually what chaff lanes are. They send out fireflies that um, that then block signals via the magic of fireflies. By the magic of Disney. Metal Gear Solid, made by Disney. Well, everything's made by Disney these days. Well, they do variants on it, at the very least. Or it's owned by Disney, more. rather than made by, it's owned by. It's owned by. Pop out here to... That's a wall. Nice wall. Ooh, ration. And deep freeze for extra freshness. I think I said deep fried for a minute there. Deep fried rations. I'm Solid Snake, and this is my cooking channel. <laughs> how to deep fry rations. You get a napalm bomb. That's not how you fry them, that's how you bake them. Whatever. I, don't know. I couldn't think of military hardware that would allow you to fry something. There aren't many. To be fair, it you can would get be weird grade... if there were. To be fair, you can get military grade fries. It's just not weaponry that would do the job for you. Unless you're in a real desperate situation, you've got, you've got like, the MacGyver on your team who can make a weapon out of anything. That's MacGyver, though. Yes. MacGyver. Metal Gear Solid waiting for renovators. And uh, a lot of it. <laughs> oh, of course, it's our one true friend, Elevators. Ah. That's not a happy sound. That's never a good noise. <laughs> we actually got a question yes, mark above the head. Yes, you got the head. Huh, I wonder what that was. Ah, not important. I love how there's a button for the ninth and the first floor. All other floors in between are irrelevant. Do, 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 do. Snake, there's something I forgot to tell you before. What? There were five stealth camouflage prototypes in my lab. Uh, yeah, so? If you take out the one I'm wearing, that leaves four. Hey, this isn't first grade math class. <laughs> I thought I'd get one for you. So I went back to it's the lab math, and... It's not math, it's not math. They're all gone. The four suits yeah. were missing. Mmm. <laughs> Work it out as you go. <laughs> it's really strange. It was like someone was intentionally holding it. When you were riding on it, did the weight limit warning go off? That's another thing that bothered me about it. The warning went off, and I know I couldn't be over the limit. How much do you weigh? About 135. But that elevator had a weight limit of 650 pounds. It would take at least five people to go over that limit. Oh, the penny's going to drop in a moment. Yes. The guys who stole my stuff <laughs> prototypes are in there with you. Of course, yeah, they it's audio, shot. but we can see him. Yes. Well, they shoot me while I was on the phone. And bullshit, they weren't there originally. Um, aha, I see you! Uh oh, stun grenade. This is a bastard of a fight. It's very tight. It's four of them in very tight quarters. There's a stun. It doesn't stun me for some reason. It's one of those picky stun grenades. Ah, one of those what? Ah, picky stun grenades. It stuns them, but it doesn't stun me. Ow. Somehow, the video seems to move in a slightly different sort of way when you're in this mode. Yeah, it's probably the, uh, just the just the animations are. They seem the more PS1 fluid going. Ah! Um, well, this is a bit easier it, to run. It seems more fluid. If that makes there's, sense. Yeah, it's probably because there's less text just being rendered. It runs at a higher frame rate. Although now I lost track of which one's me. And um, <laughs> we all look the same. Oh, there we go. You can't see them without. But their self camouflage is bullshit. And um, epic elevator fight. Drop those guns and fight me like a man. That's two downs. <laughs> they turn into loot boxes, that means you're dead. And he's down for the count. Boom, boom. First floor. Restaurant. Ah, well, that was a lot quicker down. Rather than walking down. Do, 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 do. Always check in the opposite direction the game wants you to go. It's always treasure. Aha! Uh -huh, I knew it! Ooh, ammo for my sniper rifle. I wonder if that could be setting something. I know there's a turret in that door. Eat grenade. 
do do Aha, uh -huh, I was right. Do do and there are more turrets down these corridors. Just keep lobbing chaff grenades. Ammo for me, ammo for me. Ooh, outside again in the snow. Yes, that's a wolf. Time for round two of this fight. Okay, credit to Twin Snakes. In Twin Snakes, he does dive behind cover before ringing, ringing the phone. Snake, are you okay? Because really, why doesn't she just shoot me? Were there any other stealth prototypes? No, there were only five. So, this is the stealth camouflage then. What are you talking about? Someone's aiming at me in the middle of this blizzard. It's her. Wolf? <laughs> Sniper wolf? Yes, it's her. Do you know anyone else with with the cover name Wolf? Uh, no, there is no one else with the name Wolf. No, I'm not. So then, what is it? Snake, please don't kill her. Are you insane? Please, she's a good person. You'd know that if you talked to her. Listen to me, kid. She's a merciless killer. I can see you perfectly. Also able to hack into my phone calls. Um. <laughs> I told you. I never quit the hunt. Now you're mine. Wolf. No, you can't. Don't get between a wolf and its prey. You're pretty good if you can hit me in this storm. You see, women naturally make better soldiers. Wolf, don't do this. Snake, I'm near. Can't you sense me near you? It's a mistake for a sniper to reveal her location. Is that right? Well, I'm going to send you a love letter, my dear. Do you know what that is? It's a bullet straight from my gun to you. Anyone else feel like we're sort of in the middle of... Snake, no! Yeah, just like, let them have the... Yeah, it's kind of like, right, they're flirty. I'm just going to sort of just play gooseberry here. I'm right in front of Volicon as well. Snakey bastard. Now I could have another sniper battle with her, but oh. I'm a cheap, I'm a cheap son of a bitch. I have remote control missiles. What are we doing? Oh, so you're gonna <laughs> find cover. Don't have to get my head shot off. Sadly, you can't fire but I'm, you know, I'm lying down. So yeah, I can just use remote control missiles as killer. I'm not putting my stick in my neck out. I even highlights where she is. So, this this is called useful. cheating the boss fight. <laughs> Although not the best way you can cheat your boss by in, in Metal Gear Solid, Solid Series. There are some great ways. There she is. Ah, come back here. See, are you happy now she's wearing a coat? Well, you I would imagine so. You complained about, about her was. boobs last time. I complained about her cleavage. Get it right. <laughs> um, she's now wearing a coat. <laughs> I would imagine so in a blizzard where it's that cold out there. Do, do, do. Cheat in the boss fight. Oh, no, sniper battle. Not with these controls. Also, because Snake needs to have really shaky hands because he can't keep his hands steady without the use of drugs. Right in the ass. <laughs> cheating. So very cheating. It's more fun with the first person missile mode. Do, 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 do. Pretty much what this is. Me just firing missiles. Don't worry, you get a nice scene at the afterwards. A nice scene. Well, nice it's scene. well, well, heart wrenching, sad, but oh, not again. Um, complete We've with been music. Through this already. Oh. Now the end of the Metal Gear Solid Three. That's sad and tragic. <laughs> do 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 do. Uh, but I sadly have to go around the cliffs because you can't change the altitude of this thing. In fact, I think I hit the cliff at one point. Which is really irritating. You're like, Aah. And she always moves around. There she, there she is. I think she would shoot the missiles out of the air. <laughs> do, 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 do. 
do. Stay still! Stay still! Let me hit you! Uh, oh, where'd she go? Where'd she go? Uh, oh, we hit the tree. Good job I got plenty of these things. Alright. I don't think you actually need these after this. Don't you think you do? Because you got other boss fights here. Vulcan Raven. Although they can be useful against Vulcan Raven. And, um. You stingers to defeat a Metal Gear Rex. Balance to the kneecap. She's almost dead. You're almost there. Do 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 do. Cliff. Ah, oh, hit the cliff. Why can't I change the altitude in this, in this thing? Okay, realistic reason. There's not enough buttons on the PlayStation One controller to do. It might possibly not the programming required to actually change the altitude of these things. Yeah, there she is. Oh, missile tells me who my enemy is. How does this missile know who my enemies are? This missile, missile is, it's, a, it's a smart bomb. These missiles are, are, are presuming who my enemies are. He's your enemy, he's your enemy, he's your enemy. That's the current. They're all your enemy. They'll all the be your enemy in the end. Wow. This is a paranoid missile. <laughs> Everyone, man. It wears Tim Foyle on missile head. Bit. It's pretty awful, really, from this radar system. She's dead. She's yeah. dead. Didn't even break a sweat. Um. What the hell was that? At every boss fight, you get more into your health bar. Do do do. No, I should be fine. She's only bleeding profusely from several wounds. Ooh, loot. Ah, oh, yeah, I'm gonna have a slap about the weather. Oh well. Oh, where's my box of tissues? If I didn't know better, I'd say part of you enjoys these death sequences. I am a sniper. <laughs> well, there's always the, I don't know, enjoy. There's my plastic hair that doesn't move. He, she cuffed blood there. That's not attention to detail. By a missile. That one shot by a missile. Just finish me quick. Oh god. Where do we play this game? Music Torture. Yeah. Oh no, music. Oh god! Her it's and the like wolves. a man just get the sad ending. What? Her and like a man just get the sad the tragedy. Well, the others don't. Well, I'll stop the Falcon Raven just dies. Liquid's too hammy to have a tragedy. That mm. was my life. Each morning I'd wake up and find a few more of my family or friends dead beside me. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, she's actually talking about the, um... Second God. Kurdish Iraqi War. Yeah. In real life. Oh, God, this we is don't really... know how old... This game takes place in 2004. We don't actually know exactly how old she is. This is... This is properly pulling at my heartstrings, actually. Oh, yeah, it does. This is probably the moment most people remember from this game. Oh, the death of Sniper Wolf. Bad. I just no, want to know what's behind that level seven door. Not from inside, but from the outside. As an observer, I watched the brutality, the stupidity of mankind with the scope of my rifle. I joined this group of revolutionaries to take my revenge. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
You're right. The video is just going to be us watching this really rather than us commentating, isn't it? You don't You're right. Over this scene. I know that, I didn't want to. Music's very good. Fluid again. Now the exit's around here somewhere. Uh, in the bathroom, over here, away from all the fighting. If it ah, no, I'm visible, mostly. Is that your sound effect for going invisible? Yes. Let him run off. Woo! That's how he runs. And the worst kicker is level seven door. You can't get in. Damn. You're kidding me. Damn you, game. 
So yeah, that was the uh, death of Sniper Wolf. Oh, that, was a, <laughs> that was a mine there. I'm fine. Ow, and there's, and there's the death well. of Snake. All right, we've got this. Uh, now, the real funny if I died there. That was funny. Um. So yeah, that was the uh, death of Sniper Wolf. Oh, that's out this point in the game. Go. Also, we're approaching the end of disc one. Disc one. This game comes on two discs. Um, ah. It's that much. Uh, I'm assuming that means we're more or less halfway. Uh, no, you're well past halfway. Disc two. Disc two is literally. You got one, two more boss, one more boss fight, and you've got the final boss. It's literally just this hangar around. Oh, all right. Gear. That's a lot. So you're okay. past the halfway point of the game. We need to cheer up. We need some proverbs. I wouldn't call that that's exactly a particularly happy one to cheer up on well, the floor. It's, it, it, it's, it's just in a tiny little end to the moment. Now she's just giving me a sign treatment. So how was the death of Sniper Wolf? Heart-wrenching, you know heart perfectly well. Heart-wrenching, heart I've never been so sad in my life. Uh, I have, but that still it was. That's proper emotional again. The music. Uh... Well, yeah, the music as well. It's the tragedy of her backstory and everything. Hmm. One of the many war orphans, Big Boss had a habit of collecting. Because he gets a few. Because she was a child during the Iraqi Kurdistan War. Lost her parents, her family, pretty much everyone drew the war. Big it Boss works, it's the idea of Big why. Boss found her as a child, took her back to outer heaven, trained her as a soldier, she became a sniper. Isn't that the backstory for most superhero stroke supervillains? Their parents die, it's the backstory for most people in fiction. Yeah. Well, it's the, it's the whole thing, they're a victim of tragedy, and in that sense, they are. It's the whole thing of. They choose who they want to be after that moment. Well, you would argue he trains a child to be a soldier. How much choice was made yeah. for her? But, yeah. that's assuming that. So, yeah, so we're heading towards the, towards the end of the game. We've still got a bit of way to go. A lot more speeches and plot twists. Oh, the plot twists will start coming. 